Hey everyone, welcome back to Brutal Reviews. Today, we're talking about the MSI A520M, a pro motherboard. On paper, it looks solid, supports AMD Ryzen 5000, has DDR4 slots, PCIe 3.0, M.2, all the basics you need for a budget gaming rig. Many users love it because it's cheap, reliable, and easy to set up. But here's the kicker, people aren't exactly thrilled. So let's dive into why some users are actually frustrated with it. Issue number one, VRM heating problems. Some users reported that the VRMs get hot under even moderate load, which isn't great if you're running a Ryzen 5000 CPU. MSI kinda skipped on proper cooling here. Issue number two, limited PCIe lanes. You only get PCIe 3.0 x16 for graphics and limited lanes elsewhere. That's fine for budget builds, but if you plan to expand, you'll hit a wall quickly. Issue number three, basic audio chip. The onboard audio is passable at best, but don't expect high quality sound without an external sound card. Gamers and audiophiles might feel cheated. Issue number four, minimal connectivity. You get a handful of USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports, DVI and HDMI, and that's basically it. Forget fancy USB-C or tons of USB 3.2 Gen 2 ports. Issue number 5, BIOS limitations. Some users complained that BIOS updates can be tricky and even minor updates caused boot issues. Not ideal if you like tinkering. Issue number 6, no PCIe 4.0 support. If you are hoping to future-proof your build, forget it. Only PCIe 3.0, so next-gen SSDs and GPUs won't fully shine. Issue number seven, build quality concerns. Finally, a few users mentioned cheap feeling components and stiff RAM slots. Not a deal breaker, but feels like corners were cut. So here's the brutal truth. MSI A520M, a pro is a solid budget motherboard if you just want a basic Ryzen build and don't plan to overlock or expand much. But if you expect premium features, great cooling or future proofing, you'll be disappointed. Want it anyway? Check the buy link in the description and save yourself some research headaches.